Hey, today we're going to DeSoto Falls, and we're not talking about Georgia. We're talking about Alabama, Fort Payne, Alabama. And it's not at DeSoto State Park. It's outside of DeSoto State Park. <laughs> so we're totally lost. <laughs> we just want to give you a heads up on this. It's also in the area that's called TAG. And which stands for Tennessee, Alabama, Georgia, because they all come together in this Cloudland Canyon area. So anyway, we hope you enjoyed this trip. So come along with us, because we are loving the real world. Look at these rocks. There's something in the book. Apparently this area, it's shale underneath. And so it's eroded in two different ways. One chemical from like animal and plant byproducts, whatever. The other environmental from like the rain. And apparently, it washes the shell out underneath the rock, whatever kind of rock it was. And um, that's why they formed this way. So you could have took a shortcut right down through there. <laughs> <laughs> if I was a kid, that's the way I would have came. I know. I'm glad you decided that you were an old man today. Can't go around it, can't go over it, can't go under it. We gotta go through, through it. it. Yeah. <laughs> what's the what's the saying? When you travel through the valley of Shadow of Death, yeah. no fear no evil, for thou art with me. Exactly. So that's where I feel like right now. <laughs> I think we're in the valley of death. Hopefully not. Oh, but it's too pretty. <laughs> Goodness. Is this not crazy? It is. I mean, just this itself is like, wow. I guess that guy would say, you're looking at rocks. <laughs> <laughs> I just can't get over this. He's stoned. He was bold. That tree tried to grow, but I don't think he made it. No. But look, I mean, like, we're almost holes. there, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're almost there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a little ways to go. <laughs> do good, do good. Right, I hope you, I hope you tell me it's worth the trip, though. It is. It uh, is worth it. Yeah. It is. Oh, you don't know yet. When you get home tonight, you might decide, huh? Yeah, but he's probably done it a hundred times. It is worth it. Great, great, great. It'll wear you out. This is just coming up, okay. <laughs> but don't worry about that, don't you? Okay, we won't worry <laughs> about that. Thank y'all. I hope that rock don't fall on my head. It really, it's just kind of balanced mm -hmm, right there. Mm -hmm. And I didn't bring my rock climbing gear. You've never been rock climbing. That's why I didn't bring it. I've never seen anything like this. Just it's just beautiful, really. Uh, going six months not being able to walk, she's out here doing steep terrains on rocky surfaces. Don't tell the doctor. Don't. Yeah. We don't want the doctor to find out or the insurance company. And I see a Kegler house coming up on the right up here. Sorry, all I can do is look down. Well, you need to look down. <laughs> It looks like they even put in a back door. Wow. I don't know how that tree's standing. That's crazy. I think it's three quarters of a mile one way and four miles on the way back. <laughs> water. I see water. I think I'm gonna wait till the next turn 
It's running that way. Oh. Look how clear that water is. I know, I can't believe it. It has to be coming off the mountain. Laying up against the rock. Nice rock. I can hear the waterfall. Oh, wait a minute. I know. This is sweet shrub. Sweet shrub. Sweet shrub, yeah. I've never heard of that. We used to have it at the other house. Oh, really? Yeah. What? What's this right here? This stuff that's... I guess that's rhododendron. Rhododendron, I guess. It's bloomed out. No, uh, it's not going to be easy, but... I'm coming to get you. I'm waiting. <laughs> I'm just trying to get to the edge. All right. I don't know. I think I still need to go down with that one, even though it's down with a bat. Look at that. That's mountain laurel. That's mountain laurel. Yes, we found some. Mountain laurel. It's bloomed out so pretty, too. It is. Uh oh, and here comes. But, oh no, not the swamp. <laughs> I said that, didn't I? It's my fault. <laughs> I'm having flashbacks of Laurel, oh, no. Laurel Falls. <laughs> flashbacks of Laurel Falls. And I wonder if that's why Laurel Falls is called Laurel Falls because there's so much mountain oh, laurel. I guess. I don't know. Look at that with a reflection of the rock in the water. Yeah. Oh. Did these two come together? Don't what? tell me, sweetheart. What? That other trail comes down. Did it, it come that It meets right here. Uh, we don't know. We guess we need to go back that way to see the cave. Yeah. But we'll miss the, the Savoy Rock. Yeah, we'll miss the Savoy Rock. Ice Box Cave, and, yep. Mm -hmm. And Bluff Trail. Bluff. Oh my goodness. Hi. Hey, y'all. Oh, Chloe. Chloe. Hi, Chloe. Hey, Chloe. Hey, Chloe. <laughs> hey, Chloe. <laughs> what, no. what, what breed is it? She's a long-haired chihuahua. A long-haired chihuahua. My goodness. So cute. So cute. She is. Go ahead. Ah. Oh, goodness. Oh. Now, look at this rock formation here. Oh my, it almost looks like a fence that's been built, you know, instead of... Well, you know what it reminds me of? A rock outcropping. It reminds me of, uh, what's that, a uh, Marvel character that looks oh, like a rock? yes. A, yes. Any minute he's going to come alive. Yes. Watch your step, that rock right there. Because you can see his teeth. <laughs> see his teeth. It sure can. It sure can. Amazing. Okay, More another rocks. tricky session. Some rocks. For a while here. Didn't bring my rock climbing equipment. I didn't either. Daggummit. Hi there. Hello. <laughs> I, I did side and I assume we were going through here. <laughs> well, she's got, she's got it figured out. Oh, the dog does. Has no trouble. Okay, watch this. This is before it blooms out. This is when it's bloomed. And this is when it's full bloom. That's oh, just gorgeous. Okay, we have a sneak peek. We only got probably a hundred yards to go. Sneak peek, sneak peek, sneak peek. 
Yeah. I don't know if you can see it or not, but we made it to DeSoto Falls down here. Gorgeous. It's just unreal. And the terrain down here, just a little bit tricky. So we Very went to the riverside, right? The river. riverside. Riverway. Yeah, that was the longest trail. Mm -hmm. But we're going to go back the uh, bluff. bluff side. And uh, we're hoping it's going to be a lot easier. <laughs> Not. Because but most there's of, a cool cave. <laughs> there's a cool cave on the way back. So we're going to check it out. But look at this falls. Oh, my goodness. That is just unreal. Look at the falls on top of the falls. Oh my goodness. I can see that from the Yeah, there's like two, there's one, two, three, and then the major fourth falls there. Beautiful. Yes. Looks like a great swimming hole, but I didn't buy my swimming trucks, but some people do. I don't know if you see them over there. Icebox Cave Trailhead via Bluff Trail. So we came in the Riverside Trail. Now we're going back the Bluff side. We're not, we don't know what we get ourselves into. No. This is a little bit shorter of a trail. Does that mean? What? What does that mean? <laughs> uh, hopefully it means that the climb's at the beginning of the trail. Yes. And then it flattens out. Levels out. out. Dead. Hey, Mr. Turner, when yep. you said how you're supposed to build on a foundation on a rock. Up in that little hole, it's probably 15 or 20 degrees cooler than it is everywhere else. We are just getting back in the swing of things. So last week we forgot the GoPro. This week we've got packed water. Plus we changed our plans and did the hike instead of just the view from the top. I would give this an old folks rating of a 10, but since I'm just getting out of the boot, it probably really is an eight, but it is not the distance it is the elevation change and the rough terrain that makes it so hard there are very few true pass areas it's mostly climbing in and around boulders we hope you enjoyed this little adventure and hope you join us again real soon thank you to our subscribers and if you have not subscribed please hit the subscribe button it's free and it really helps us out also tell us about the places you've been in the comments below and until next time, we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.